Dan Hawkins from Hearst, Texas, just outside of Dallas, in the hot seat right now. Congratulations on, you. on getting here. And accompanied by uh, your wife, Jennifer. How are you doing, Jennifer? Just fine. Nice to have you here. First time in New York City for Jennifer, huh? Yeah, it's yeah. her first time. Well, now, Dan, you're a, a computer guy. Yeah. And you also have a part-time job. Yeah, I do. Uh, three or four times a month, I uh, model for uh, college art classes. Yeah. yeah. Do you model nude? Usually. Yeah, you know, I did the same thing. Oh, you did? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, okay. No kidding. You stand there nude, huh? Stand, yeah. sit, whatever. You're not a shy guy, are you? I used to be. <laughs> not anymore. Not anymore. I got a little sore throat from the last class I did. Yeah, it's chilly in there, I'll bet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and Jennifer, do you mind? No, I love it. I think it's great. <laughs> really? What do we have here, folks? <laughs> Oh, uh, well, somebody's got to do it, right, Dan? Yeah, somebody's got to do you're it. You're the guy. I mean, they need to learn uh, how to draw anatomy. And, That's uh, right, yeah. After a while, it just becomes another job. Thank God you're the man for the job. Yeah. <laughs> you know about the rules. Yes. You know about the lifeline. Yes. You know how much money you're playing for? It's a lot of bucks here, yes. Dan. Let's do it. Let's play you Wants to Be a Millionaire with Dan Hawkins. $100. If you reduce something to its basic elements, it is said you're getting down to the what? This is what you do three times a week, right? <laughs> Sitting pretty, nitty gritty, Emerald City, Hello Kitty. Uh, that'd be B, nitty gritty. That's it. You get down to the nitty gritty. For $200, check it out. Which of these pieces of office equipment is the most likely to break down due to a paper jam? Photocopier, pencil sharpener, desk lamp, inbox. Uh, photocopier, final answer. Yes, photocopy for $200. <laughs> Going now for $300. A person who muzzles a dog prevents it from doing which of the following? Biting, running in traffic, chasing its tail, gossiping. Uh, that'd be A, biting, final answer. Yes, you prevent the dog from biting somebody else. Here it is for $500. Which of these musical instruments normally rests on the floor when being played? Is it a viola, French horn, harp, tuba? Would be uh, C, harp. That's it, the harp. <laughs> Up to $1,000. Roman gladiator contest took place at which of the following sites? Pyramids, Acropolis, Basilica, Colosseum. Uh, D, Colosseum, final answer. Yes, they took place in the Colosseum. <laughs> Going for $2,000 right now. Who was the first judge on the people's court? serving from 1981 to 1993. Lance Ito, Joseph Wapner, Mills Lane, Greg Mathis. Uh, B, Wapner, final answer. Yes, Joe Wapner, People's Court. <laughs> Up to $4,000. Which of these countries is not completely surrounded by water? Japan. Australia, Italy, New Zealand. Uh, Italy, final answer. Italy it is for $4,000. We're cruising, going for 8000 right now. Which of the following organisms does not get nourishment through photosynthesis? Mushroom, fern, cactus, moss. I have to say A, mushroom. Uh, final answer. Mushroom is the right answer. <laughs> Going for $16,000. The ferret, otter, and wolverine are all members of what animal family? The rodent, the primate, marsupial, weasel. I 
think I know what it is, but I'm going to call the audience. Okay, audience, he finally needs idea. your help. Here it comes. If you're ready, on your keypads, using A, B, C, or D, vote now. That's what I thought. Uh, the weasel, final answer. He said final answer. He's right for 16,000. It's the weasel family. We're going to break. Well, the bats has got six to go until $2,070,000. He's a computer support network administrator and also a uh, part-time nude model. You know, I don't want to dwell on this. <laughs> oh. I really don't, you know. But uh, do you have to audition to get this job? No. No. Uh, they took you sight unseen. Yeah. They pref prefer a wide range of body types. Uh, what range are you? <laughs> I'm pretty uh, ordinary, <laughs> actually. Is that right, Jennifer? Okay. <laughs> <I don't think laughs> Pretty ordinary guy, huh? Yeah. I mean, regular proportions. But, yeah. Uh, and you're not shy at all? Not anymore. I mean, it was hard to... What first was the time. first night like? Uh, it was a little scary, although there were only two older women in the class drawing that night. Uh, Just two older women? Yeah. How uh, old That was they? the night that Ronald Reagan won the election over Walter Mondale. So a lot of people stayed home, watched the returns. Yeah. Not yeah. that it was that competitive. But well, that's a long time ago. Yeah. So you're a veteran. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, let's get back to the game. All right, okay. Dan, enough about you and your part-time job. Okay. <laughs> We're going for $32,000 here. Let's play. Okay, Dan, here it comes. On a box of Cap'n Crunch cereal, which of these is a characteristic of Cap'n's eyebrows? Are they missing? On his hat? They touch, they purple. I'll take the 50-50. Okay, computer, narrow it down by two, please. They're either missing or they're on his hat. I thought they were on his hat. Picture I'm gonna go, say, go ahead and say B on his hat. On his hat, final answer. Final answer. Todd has had the right answer for 32,000. Okay, he's five away, going for 64,000, and check it out. What is carved on Plymouth Rock? 1620. God protect us. Names of the first pilgrims. Picture of the Mayflower. I see cartoons all the time with just 1620. Since this is a freebie, I'm going to go ahead and say 1620. Okay. Uh, final answer. You saw it right! 64,000! 1620! Who says you can't learn anything from cartoons? Yeah. Just gave, just gave Bates a $64,000 winner. Four away, and you can still phone a friend, and we're going for $125,000. In the 2000 film, Oh Brother, Where Art Thou?, the main characters are disguised as what music group? The Backwater Band, the River Rats, the Soggy Bottom Boys, the Kentucky Colonels. Call John on this. Who's John? He's a friend of mine on the internet. We belong to a group that watches the show and tries to get on a lot. Terrific. Let's uh, get John on the line, see if he can help us. Hello? Hello, John. Yeah. Regis Philbin calling from Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. How you doing? Okay. I'm here with Dan. He needs your help. Okay? Yep. All right, he's going to uh, read a question and give you the four possible answers, and he's going for $125,000. All right, Dan, it's all yours. 30 seconds right now. In the movie, Oh Brother, Where Art Thou?, 
the main characters are disguised as what music group? The Backwater Band, the River Rats, the Soggy Bottom Boys, the Kentucky Colonels. And you got 15 seconds. Five seconds. I don't know. Okay, thanks. Colonels were a basketball team in the ABA, so I don't think it's that. I don't think they would call them that. But I haven't seen the movie yet, so. Well, no guts, no glory. Uh, C, soggy bottom boys. Final answer? Final answer. My gosh, you got it right for a hundred. Very good. We're going to come back. He's just three questions away from two million seventy thousand in just a moment. Five thousand dollars. Nice piece of change. Was that a guess on that last question? It was a guess. Uh, I might have seen a review of that thing, mm -hmm. and that mm -hmm. thing just. Popped into my head real quick. Well, thank God for it that. It really was a guess, though. Now we're just three questions away, you know, and you're going for a quarter million dollars. Time to think about what you're going to do with this money. Well, that's easy. We're in the middle of building a house and uh, hoping the brick is done this week. Yeah. Here you go. $250,000. Okay. Feeling strong? Yeah. Okay. Let's get back to it. Let's play. Three questions away. Three more. Damn. Buddhism originated in a region found in which present-day country? Japan. China. Pakistan. India. I'm going to say B, China. Just like that, you'll lose 93,000. Uh, I think it's China, though. Final answer? Final answer. Dan, it's India. it's India. Back to 32. Back to 32. Well, you took a chance. You were a great contestant. Thanks very much. Oh, boy. The key word in that question was originated. Buddhism originated more than 2,600 years ago on the Ganges River in India. Feel badly for Dan, but he really thought he knew.